we have a new addition to our family and uh, she is the best surprise gift i have ever got from anyone in my life i wanted to adopt another cat for a very long time and she is the one who found her ways to us She's about 1 and 1/2 months old and she is totally adorable for a ball. As of now we are thinking to name her Sophie. Uh, let me know if you have any other name suggestion for her. Recently we have shifted to this new place and it is so lovely to have such a sweet companion. So far I've understood that handling a Persian cat is way much easier than handling an Indian one but uh, since she's all white and all furry I think I'll have a big time <laughs> keeping her clean and uh, fluffy so let's see how I get to do that task and thankfully she doesn't eat any of my plants she just plays with them so that's a good thing to know about we both are kind of exploring this new apartment together and uh, this place is now kind of set and i plan to share my journey of how i decorated or set up all this place in the next few videos but before that i wanted to show you my little new furry friend Summer has kicked in and that too in full swing and I have started treating myself with my favorite fruits like mango, muskmelon and watermelon of course. And I got to understand that watermelon also happens to be the favorite fruit of my new kitten. I'm not sure if I should allow her to eat this but certainly she doesn't allow me to eat if I don't share this with her. I found this new way of cutting watermelon which I would say makes it more interesting. I think it makes me be present in the moment and uh, be mindful of what I'm doing and what I'm eating. As I mentioned earlier my apartment is kind of set now and I'll be sharing detailed video in the coming few weeks. Uh certainly these last few weeks or rather months were very hectic and stressful especially because we moved to another city and setting up this entire place was a bit hectic but uh what I think helped me is keeping my heart open. Uh, and that is when these little angel find their way to our life and provide us much needed a company she hasn't started jumping over places and that's a sign of relief for me because i need to train her a lot while she is in her uh, growing stage and uh, most importantly she cannot jump on the dining table and grab everything that she could eat how can i forget mentioning shasha in all this equation uh, he initially was very scared of a uh, new kitten as he's always scared of everything but uh, later on looks like they love to play together uh, he loves to uh, keep her clean that's very strange and i think she's not understanding that thing and then they end up fighting every time <laughs> but uh, that's really sweet to see and i think they will uh, gel up very well in the next coming few days she is uh, very playful and uh, very curious as any kitten would be and by each passing day i think she is growing and learning new things which is a good sign 
initially i had so many apprehension whether they will be able to live together or not uh, but nowadays i think they are liking each other's company and one more good thing about her is that she can play by herself so she doesn't need that much attention and i'm sure when she grows uh, this will become even more easy to handle So far what I have known is having her along with Sasha has been extremely rewarding for me and I hope our unconditional love and companionship grows stronger by the time. So you will be seeing her a lot in the coming videos as I said she is all over the place and see you in the next video.